Construction processes have evolved significantly with the advent of technology and 3D printing has emerged as a popular method for constructing new buildings. A notable innovation in this field is the API's Core 3D Mobile Printer, which introduces the concept of mobile printing. This printer, equipped with a rotating arm, operates from within the building under construction, covering an area of 132 square meters. Its compact size, ease of transport, and absence of preparation time make it a versatile tool. The installation and configuration of the API's core take only 30 minutes. With dimensions reaching 4 by 1 to 6 by 1.5 meters, the machine's prints are compact, and it weighs 2 tons, allowing standard equipment for transport. Notably, only two trained workers are required to oversee the entire process, controlling the material flow. The printer utilizes fiber concrete, a form of cement concrete, applied layer by layer, minimizing construction waste. The Carabane is an innovative invention designed to fulfill the dream of a completely autonomous outdoor lifestyle. This self-sufficient home rotates around its axis, optimizing solar energy capture through solar panels and a retractable wind turbine. It goes beyond energy generation by incorporating a rainwater collection and purification system. Once assembled, the carabane spans 7.8 meters, featuring a kitchen, two bedrooms, a bathroom, and a porch, all mounted on a mobile platform. The house can be installed by one person in approximately 30 minutes and special sensors continuously track the sun to maximize energy collection. While not yet mass-produced, prototypes are available for purchase at $400,000. Tree trimming using a helicopter may sound like a concept from fantasy, but it is a practical reality. This process employs a specialized circular saw blade, with steel blades arranged beneath each other, powered by a standard diesel engine. The helicopter, equipped with the saw, hovers above the trees, moving in a straight line to effectively trim branches. Precision is crucial, requiring careful control of both the helicopter and the cutting mechanism. This method is commonly employed near power lines to prevent branches from making contact with cables, reducing the risk of accidents. Preform specializes in designing and manufacturing advanced 3D scanners, and their latest product, the Goiskin Spark, stands out for its technological prowess. Watch this here. This portable 3D scanner is tailored to increase productivity, especially for designers and engineers. With four built-in cameras, it ensures high-speed 3D scanning, providing quick and accurate data, including color information about the object. The ergonomic design enhances usability, allowing the scanner to be held comfortably in any position. Its capabilities make it a valuable tool for digitizing physical objects at various stages of product development, contributing to error reduction in the process. Amazon made a significant leap in drone technology when it introduced small drones for delivering lightweight packages to customers in the UK in 2016. These drones are capable of delivering purchases weighing up to 2.3 kilograms within half an hour. Amazon's drone, designed as a helicopter with propellers and a computerized control system, is mounted at the center and top of the frame. The drones have a maximum flying altitude of 120 meters and can reach speeds of up to 80 kilometers per hour. As technology advances, Amazon continues to enhance the design and features of its delivery drones, including the development of a drone tower for launching and returning the drones with orders. If you've ever wondered about the tools used to cut glass tubes, the German company Arnold Grupp manufactures specialized equipment for this purpose. Operated by a single person, the machine delivers high productivity, cutting glass tubes within seconds. The equipment is designed to work with tubes ranging from 80 to 150 millimeters in diameter, 
demonstrating its versatility by being powerful enough to cut materials spanning 20 to 400 millimeters in thickness. The cutting process involves placing the tube into roller units, pressing it against an adjustable stopper to ensure uniform lengths, and using a diamond disc to cut the glass cleanly. A burner, supported on a long arm, is then used to apply a flame of hydrogen or oxygen, inducing the glass to crack along the cut. This tool is suitable for various types of glass, including soda glass, lead glass, and borosilicate glass. Let's discuss Waymo, a subsidiary of Alphabet, specializing in autonomous driving technologies. The autonomous systems developed by Waymo incorporate data from various sources, including Google Street View, a video camera, LiDAR sensor, radar in the front, and a sensor connected to a rear wheel to facilitate mapping and positioning. Waymo unveiled a fully autonomous car without a steering wheel or pedals in May 2014 marking a significant development in self-driving technology. The autonomous vehicles from Waymo have undergone extensive testing, covering over 8 million kilometers, despite encountering challenges such as parking difficulties, issues with recognizing urban waste, and limitations in adverse weather conditions. Waymo has set a goal to deploy fully autonomous cars by the year 2020. Companies involved in mass production of pre-cooked food require highly efficient and automated equipment to maintain productivity. The industrial vegetable peeling machine shown in the video is manufactured by the German company, Hydron Pro. Specifically, the UP8000 model is designed for peeling oblong vegetables like carrots, radishes, zucchinis, and manioc. The automated process involves each vegetable passing through the roller system multiple times, ensuring thorough peeling, and requires minimal human intervention. The machine can peel up to 8,000 vegetables per hour, provided they meet certain size criteria, with a length exceeding 160 mm and a diameter between 25 and 70 mm. It's important to note that, during the process, each vegetable loses approximately 18 to 20 percent of its initial weight. This remarkable structure is a part of the Beijing-Shanghai High-Speed Railway. The Danyang Kunshan Grand Bridge is recognized as the longest bridge globally and holds a place in the Guinness Book of Records. While the total length of the construction is 164.8 kilometers, only 9 kilometers of the road are above water. Situated in eastern China between the cities of Nanjing and Shanghai, the bridge started construction in 2008 and became operational in 2011. Over 10,000 people participated in the construction, utilizing advanced technology and working simultaneously on both ends. The bridge required 2.5 million cubic meters of concrete and 500,000 tons of steel, with estimated costs ranging from 8 to $10.5 billion. Traditional methods of removing graffiti often come with drawbacks, such as damaging the underlying paint layer or causing harm to surfaces like sandblasting dust. Addressing these issues, the German company Sistico has introduced the Tornado ACS system, providing a gentle and eco-friendly approach to graffiti removal. This system doesn't rely on harmful chemicals or high pressure. Instead, it utilizes a vacuum. A special compartment adheres to the dirty surface, pulling the paint out without damaging the structure. The Tornado ACS is versatile, suitable for indoor and outdoor use on various surfaces. Workers can adjust the power and granulate type to match specific surfaces, including delicate materials like glass. This is the end of the video. Please drop the like button and subscribe for more exciting videos coming up.